everyone welcome back so we are on the same screen where we left in the previous video and uh, this time what we're gonna do we are going to uh, check the uh, logs or monitor the health because if you remember uh, it also created let me minimize this one go back to this uh, resource group which was created by kubernetes itself for other services we also uh, enabled the monitoring while we were creating and there was also a log analytic space which was getting all that data and we can utilize the insight to check what all is happening in our uh, Kubernetes, right? Uh, this is the OMS agent, right? All right, let me quickly go back here. Uh, not here, I need to go back to my Kubernetes uh, cluster. And meanwhile, I just wanna check something because I couldn't see where log analytics workspace this is the workspace okay uh which was created uh, by by default uh, all right let me go back to my kubernetes uh, services uh let me click on demo aks expand the window expand uh before i expand it let me go to the monitoring under monitoring we have insights let me click on insights and minimize this this is uh, a wonderful very very good feature uh which is recently added in kubernetes kubernetes it wasn't there before so here if i go to add filter i can simply select the namespace node and node pool what all uh, information you want to see for now let me filter it as a namespace go to all uh, cube system and we would have uh, the information uh, for example let me click the containers we would have a two containers for the back, one for the back, one for the front. And you can simply click here and view container logs. Here you can see all the logs. Uh, once you hit the, uh, the query will generate it automatically and you would have all that log. You can see standard out and error log right uh let me close this and go back to the inside I will, i'll show you there is also a live data you can also see the live data let me click on the front front is where we are hitting the public ip address let, let me try to hit this public ip address one few times and see the view live data you see uh, we started getting the uh live data here So that's how we can get the more information on health logs as per our need. Okay, so this is a very short, a small video on uh, monitoring health and checking the logs. Now, in the next video, we will uh, try to add the same uh, Kubernetes cluster to the uh, Azure container registry, okay? Or rather what we'll try, let's let, let it uh, delete, let, let us delete this uh, cluster. All right, <laughs> let's not plan it now. We'll plan uh, when we create the video, maybe tomorrow so we'll definitely go ahead and run an application maybe keeping it up and running it, it may charge a lot uh but let's see and uh, we'll try to attach this uh, aks with uh, the azure container registry from where it will get the image okay because for now it is getting from uh, docker hub 
but we want it to get it from the ACR. So what we need to do, we need to create an image, upload it to the ACR and attach the ACR with these Kubernetes services and give this Kubernetes services uh, permission to pull the image. So thank you for watching and you have a good day. Bye-bye.